Ms. Bonomack is recognized. I uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I thank my colleague, uh, Mr. Poe, for the time. I am pleased also to rise in support of the Managing Arson Through Criminal History or MATCH Act, H.R. 1727. As a member from California, I was heartened by the support that our delegation received from this House during the station fire that recently swept through our state, tragically killing two heroic firefighters. As many of you know and have just heard, some of these fires are being investigated as arson. In what is sadly becoming an annual occurrence, we are faced with the threat of catastrophic wildfires that cause millions of dollars in damage and threaten life. It is when we learn that the first sparks of these fires were caused by arsonists that our greatest fears are realized, that someone would maliciously and purposely start a fire. These events are reminders of the urgency with which we need to act in passing H.R. 1727, as this legislation was inspired by events uh, in my county, Riverside County, which I'm very proud to represent. Nearly three years ago, my community was devastated by the Esperanza fire also an arson-caused fire that cost five heroic U.S. Forest Service firefighters their lives. I, like all of my colleagues in this House, am anxious to provide all of the tools and the support we can to combat despicable acts like arson. Multiple conversations and meetings uh, with firefighters and chiefs in my district led to the creation of this bill. They told me how a central database would provide them with invaluable information in tracking arsonists, more especially serial arsonists. More help is needed in the tracking of this dangerous crime. Even though arson fires account for a majority of the fires in the U.S., the arrest and conviction rate is only 20 percent. It is our duty as members of Congress to provide the tools and the infrastructure we can to aid in both the prevention of this crime and the speedy apprehension of those who choose to commit it. It is my sincere belief that the MATCH Act will make a meaningful difference in the way we approach and deal with arson offenders by establishing a registry for law enforcement. I would like to especially thank Chairman Conyers and Scott and Ranking Members Smith and Gohmert of the Judiciary Committee. They worked to ensure that this legislation was expeditiously, expeditiously moved through the legislative process and that legitimate concerns were addressed. I would also like to thank the House leadership on both sides of the aisle for the efforts and hard work in bringing the bill before us today. And finally, I too would like to thank my fellow California, my dear friend uh, Adam Schiff, for his partnership on this important issue. I could think of no better colleague in the House of Representatives to work with uh, than I found in, in uh, Adam Schiff. So I thank you very much, and I, I yield back the balance of my time and urge passage of this critically important bill. Gentlewoman, reserves the balance of time. Gentlemen from California. Uh, Mr. Speaker.